Greetings and welcome to Cosmeteer, the Grand Admiral, Grand Fleet Admiral run. The Spork has been left behind right now on the Terror Mark II. The original Terror Mark I was a smaller version. This is a frigate slash corvette ship with currently 18 crew. The crew can consistently keep the fire up on all three weapons. There is a front laser beam and two side cannons. The cannons can fire at longer ranges, but they are mainly there as support weapon systems. As you can see, it goes quite nicely. This ship has again taken damage. My god, I don't know why I even try. Bloody useless it is. But yeah, I am enjoying this new ship. So obviously the beam only fires at certain ranges and certain distances. As you can see, it's heating up. It's... there we go. So it mainly will be getting fire from the side weapon systems. Now that, of course, will cause a few minor issues, but they're meant to be support ships, not assault ships. And the biggest issue I have right now is the fact that they aren't the best. They're workable. In fact, I'll probably just do this. Yeah, that's much better. Yeah, they're not the best. Now, it takes like a, let's see, 18 man crew, I said. Yep, 18, it's definitely 21. But the speed they can move around here is great. Like, see, it's all one big massive circle. So they go up, round, up, round. Uh, there is no current major issues with it. I'm not a big fan of the design, because it, it looks like a basic frigate slash corvette. Obviously, it's a bit internal. But I do like my own specific style. And this doesn't yet look like my style. Obviously, I'm trying to get a bit more going on the front. I have yet to paint it. Maybe the paint will make of the uh, ship. Because, obviously, manners maketh man. And, obviously, then you throw a pint glass at someone with an umbrella. But this time, I don't have an umbrella. But welcome to the Fleet the Terror Mark II. It will be gaining a new official designation. But it will be added to the list along with the Needler Mark III. There was also a fleet over here in the asteroid field, but it appears to be dead. So I'm going to go find where it is, salvage what it is, and build more terrors. It is time for the winds of change to burn people to death, because the winds of change are a little bit too hot, and the air conditioning's off. So here is the current scale of the terror compared to the needler. As you can see, the needler is a much thinner less substantial ship. This is why this would be probably be classified as a corvette in the grand scheme of things. I imagine a frigate to be more people. A corvette, I think this about sums up what this would be. It of course has a hyperdrive. I am debating what to do with my other ships hyperdrive wise because let's face it, I could probably just destroy the needlers and rebuild them on the other side. It'd be cheaper. So the needlers might get scrapped down every single time and obviously, you know, brought back in. So scrap them, bring them, scrap them, bring them, scrap them, bring them. I will have to see. I'm not too sure. I could easily build in the jumps, but then that means more and more ships. It might just simply be easier to keep the bigger ships, scrap them to the carrier and rebuild them. So the carrier might literally be rebuilding my entire fleet every single jump. So maybe no jump drives at all. This is the hyperdrive. Everything else is just a toy. Oh, you finally made it, Warmonger. About bloody time, eh? About bloody time. Ooh, two... Destroy a fringe systems resistance base. I could do that. I could do that. I don't like... Itonka and Degusa, are they the other ones? That's really a... Are they just out there somewhere? There's some stations we can kill. Well, obviously I'm going to have to. We need more crew. Let's get that faction going on. What's this? I failed this because the patrol ships are dead? Oh no, I immediately failed it. If only it had warned me. Okay, let's get both of these going on? That's some money. I've taken it. It's... Uh, pirate base is there. It's there. I mean, the only thing we can do is go and have a look and see what it looks like. Let's go see what the fleet can do about the thing over there I didn't know about. Let's bring the station with me. God damn it, let go, uh, carrier. I'll be honest, this is one of the dumber ideas I've ever had. Because the enemy has multiple mobile ships defending it, and when I hit it, I'm going to get an enemy uh, bounty response. God damn it, get off. So this... This is bad. This is very bad. 
there could be a lot of death here. An awful lot of death. Let's go. Did the missiles fire? No. It did. That was a missile fire. That's contact. That's not contact. Okay. Okay. We are pushing in. So we have a... We have a Reckless Warrior, we have, I think, a Scrap Knight, which has done significant damage to me in the other series. Small cannon plants. The actual station itself is mostly missiles, which again is a problem, but I do have the lasers. So I just need to kill this. So let's get our murder on. Here we go. That's a contact. That's no, not. Go, go, go. There we are. The beams of doom have struck. Okay, so I want you to go round to the flank. Here comes the bounties. Come on. We're going to call this a test or a fever dream. Okay, we actually need these to start pushing targets away. I mean, just to be anything. There we go. Keep it away and the beams finish it off. Okay, here come the bounties. Yeah, there we go. Because it's so focused on trying to, you know, kill my other ship. It's not getting anywhere near me. Which is great. So yeah, we're going to start doing a lot more team fight tactics. Wait, that's a different game entirely. Okay, you just pull back for now. You push forwards. Okay, the lasers are firing. Okay, shields up. More beams. More beams for the beam god. All the beams. Okay, we have second target. Both of these. Push that away. Actually, one of you push that away. You push that away. Switch targets. Uh, okay, you get into the rear of the gear. Actually, you should also push that away. That's going down. Good. There we go, that's gone. Okay, that's dead. Oh, what is that? Contact. Contact close. Contact very close. The big guy might go down. Field testing is substantial right now. Pieces of warmonger are flailing, falling, flopping. Words. Okay, I want you to get right behind it. There we are. Okay, you've got to retreat. You hit that. You hit that. There we go. Push him. Okay, you two keep on that one. You switch targets, move to that one. Take out the Scrap Knight. It's scrappy and nighty. You actually need to get behind it. You need to push to the rear with the gear. You're taking fire. Interesting. Okay, how are we doing with that? It's being pushed away. It's trying to take out the rear engine stuff. That is... Problematic is what I'd say. Bring you down to this way. How are you doing over here? Are you killing it yet? 
Are you winning, son? Okay, you need to push more to there. You need to keep going around to the flank. The rear engine is... Bernie. It's a weekend at Bernie's. Okay, you're engaging good. You're still being pushed. We're getting EMP. That's mm, problematic, is what I'd say. You're meant to be longer range, so pull back a bit further. How are you doing? You are ramming them. Okay. Bold move, Cotton. I don't think it's going to pay off for me. Okay, about to lose the rear with the gear. Twitch targets to there. Engine is going. Okay, so what have we learnt? I hate everything. What else we learnt? Not re ready for this. Okay, that's pushing. Okay, the main cannon's gone. Switch targets. Take out that. How are you doing? You're still putting the fire on like there's no tomorrow. Good. There might not be a tomorrow if you don't kill it. You're actually taking shots, which is not good. Pull back a bit to there. Okay, how's this doing? This is still ongoing. That sorrow's dead. What is that? Okay. Okay, I'm learning. More need needlers. Move in, move in, move in. Uh, target, target, target. That is a broadsider. That is a bigger problem. That is a majorly bigger problem. Oh, you've lost the front. That's an issue. Okay, you're taking hits, you're still going. You're being hit by that. Okay, your needle is still alive. Get in the rear of the gear. The tower is engaging. We've lost the main cannon. That is issuey. I told you to retreat. I guess you haven't got much. Yep. Okay. Just get behind it. Okay, switch that to that. You keep pushing that one. Why aren't you manning the gun? Keep targeting that. Keep behind it. Keep in the rear of the gear. Okay, that's going to be more damage. How are we doing over here? This needler is... dead? It's on fire. Still fighting. Still fighting. What hit it? Missiles. It's... Where are the missiles coming from? I don't see a missile launcher. Do you see a missile launcher? I don't see a missile launcher. Okay, Scrap Knight. Okay, the tower is still engaging the Scrap Knight. Definitely is better rear engine we uh, side weapons. Okay, you are now stuck. Okay, good, 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 good. Firezy beam, firezy beam. If I can kill this, that'd be great. I might lose the front. This is full on good testing. I have learned so far. I may to make a few more alterations. That's good. Beams, however, when they get the hits, are great. I may have to put a crystal on the other ship. Okay, that is down. Okay, Rawmonger is taking hits. Okay, you switch targets to that one. You, Rawmonger. No, Terror. Oh god, yeah, you actually don't have any uh, front weapons anymore? Okay, do what you can. Move it to here. We're still holding steady. Looks like we've lost engines, maybe a reactor. 
Okay, the Sabo's down. This needler's still fighting like its life depends upon it, and it genuinely might. I think I've lost a needler. Where's the needler mo Where's the needler two? There. Okay, needler two is on fire and dead. Okay, needler two is gone. The Reckless Warrior is still being hit. Again, we don't have... Okay. So, in the grand scheme of things, I didn't do the best. Dead. Okay, switch targets to that. You two engage over here. Go, go, go. So, yeah, we need to work a bit more. Okay, that's engaging me. Okay, needle is firing in. I'd like for you to pick that off at that point blank range there. I'd like for you to also be hitting that at this range here. Oh, God, those lasers can turn. Of course they can turn. I'm a moron. Okay, push to here. Actually, that means I need you to be a bit further range away then. Yeah, about there then. Yeah, this is not good at turning right now. Still, it isn't an issue. We'll work on that. The terrorist field testing requires more field testing. It is stuck on the enemy ship. Push to there, do that. Terror is retreated. Second needler is having issues. Can you repair? No. What's left of you? You've got no rear engines. Okay. You need to retreat. crystal goes down. I've lost my greatest combat capability. Okay, so you need to both turn this to keep within range. Okay, so testing has told me Doom is approaching us. Which is a bit of a problem. I don't really like the Doom. Hmm. Okay, so everything is dead. I don't know if he did very well, though. Ooh, that's a problem. Okay, the shield should be able to hold. Just wait for this to die. Wait, there's another one? Uh oh. There we go. There we go. Oh, come on. How are we holding? Just turn. Oh my god. So in the grand scheme of things, we've lost a little bit. <laughs> we've lost a little bit. So this, uh, this is a problem, is what we say in the trade. Uh, I don't think, if I'm honest, we'll be able to kill the target station. I genuinely don't think we'll be able to kill the target station. Because it has missiles. So, this has been what we call a field test. We require better production on the Terror class ship. Okay, we have learnt many things. None of them have been very good for my ego. Oh my god, we've lost so much. So grab as much as we can. It's time to start rebuilding some of our ships. Okay, you'll be done. The Mark III is still alive. The Terror is still alive. We'll work on you. So the big issue we had with this one was the fact that it couldn't really fire. Like the side guns can fire things, the front one could not. But if you push it any further, that will require a shield generator. 
Now I could technically do a shield generator, like push this forwards to there. Push these back to there and have a shield generator down here. As you can see, that caused a little bit more issue. So we could easily do that. That will shield generate the entire front. It does, however, say it requires more crew if I do that. So we'll see how this goes, I guess. So we've now got a shield... Okay, Terra Mark II has now been shield generated. We just now need to salvage everything else. So one of the needlers is now active. This needler is not active. Okay, go over to the other needler and go save it. Oh my god, the losses, man. The losses. Huge, huge losses. Okay, go salvage that one. Bring him back online. Okay, good. That's both needlers. Maybe I'll switch them out for the other generation. The, te the terrors. Oh dear. We've lost one needler. Okay, the needler Mark Three is dead completely. It, caught, it just burnt to death on fire. The Terra Mark Two are still debating the front. But there we are. So this is now, obviously, a better ship. The shield, of course, will go down. It means it takes a few less damaging hits. I think crew has died on it. Yeah, some crew has died on all the ships. That's fine-ish. I think because the front laser went off, they died. The Terra Mark, the Needle Mark Two is dead. Ugh. Goodbye, Spork One. All right, all right, all right, all right. We can rebuild. The testing has begun. The war will continue. Oh my God, there's just so much dead ship everywhere. But we did lose some reactors. Yeah, we lost several reactors. Thank God I don't need reactors, eh? That would have been expensive. <laughs> They might just be uh, trade. Uh, might be trade ships. Okay. I could try and hit a trade ship. Sod it. Let's try and hit a trade ship. 